What's going on everybody? My name is Adam. Welcome to Sanctify Studios where I like to create and examine content with a sanctifying biblical view. I've been focusing heavily on reacting to Christian music lately because I really want to highlight those artists who are being intentional about creating sanctifying and biblical content. But I've also been doing interviews on my podcast, Sanctify Radio, and I'll be producing music out of this studio for things like my band, Classic Disaster, and other projects in the future. So if that's something that you're interested in, then you can do me a huge favor. You you can leave this video a thumbs up, you can hit the subscribe button, and you can hit the notification bell so that you'll be notified when new videos arrive. And go ahead and leave me a comment. Let me know who you are and what bands you want to see on this page. With all that being said, I hope you enjoy this video. Let's go ahead and check out the new Royal Diadem cover, House of the Lord. And Royal Diadem is basically like a really, really heavy uh, worship band. It's a one-man project, John Wesley, and um, he does a really, really good job of like taking church worship songs, so the songs that you and I would be listening to on a Sunday morning, and just rocking them out, going heavy with the guitar riffs, going heavy with the solos, um, really adding a little bit more oomph to the songs, and so I really, really love um, everything that he's been doing with Royal Diadem. Got a chance to play with him, um, for the live stream event that we did way back in July uh, of last year. And another artist who was a part of that, who it was for actually, for this surrender, was James Franchise. And James Franchise actually has a feature on this song. So I'm really excited to see what it's gonna sound like. Let's go ahead and check it out. Here is Royal Diadem's cover of House of the Lord featuring James Franchise. <laughs> All right, all right. Woo! <laughs> nice. Ooh, got some deep guitar tones there. Nice. Nice strings there in the back too. We worship the God who was. Ooh, that bass. We worship the God who evermore will be. Nice. He opened the prison door. Woo! That's James Franchise right there. that those strings are still in there. We bring to the God who We bring to the God who sang. We sing to the God who always bang the wine. So chuggy. Cause he hung up on that cross. Then he rose up from that grave. My God still rolling stones away. Ooh. Nice drumming right there. So cool. There's joy in the house of the Lord today. Sounds really cool. 
really cool bass part right there. Whoa. work here you guys beautiful job and honestly like that is what you can expect from royal diadem they just take those worship songs that you know and love and just bring them up to 11 and i was totally not expecting that breakdown there in the bridge and the drums were going crazy yeah so so cool and the other the other really cool thing too is that like Sometimes you'll see people do covers of a song and they'll make it their own, right? They'll, they'll add their own flavor and it kind of changes the tone and mood of the song. Something that I found that Royal Diadem does really, really well is that he does like rough it up a little bit. He does add the aggression. He does make it his own, but it doesn't take away from the initial heart of the song because the heart of this song, right? House of the Lord, there's joy in the house of the Lord is for it to be joyful and for it to be fun and for it to be like dancing and like us being excited about the joy that we have in God. And that was still maintained even in this harder, more aggressive version of it. And I found that to be true of all the other songs that he's done covers of. Like he just does a really good job of making it his own, roughing it up a little bit, adding the aggression, adding breakdowns and solos and all that stuff, but still maintaining the heart of the song that he does a cover of. So really, really great job, you guys. Really, really great job. I really like it. Go and support Royal Diadem. Go and check out his Instagram. Go and check out his social medias. Go and check out all the songs and covers that he does. If you like aggressive music and you like worship music, then you will feel right at home in his discography. And I'm really excited to see all of the new music that he's going to be putting out this year. And go ahead and follow James Franchise as well. He's going to be putting new music through his band, This Surrender. It's going to be an awesome year, you guys. I'm excited. I really hope that you enjoyed today's video, and if you did, then you can do me a huge favor. You can leave this video a thumbs up, you can hit the subscribe button, and you can hit the notification bell so that you'll be notified when new videos arrive. And go ahead and leave me a comment below. What did you think about today's video? What are your thoughts? And what do you want to see next on the channel? And if you want to support me and what I'm doing here, one of the best ways that you can do that is to support my band, Classic Disaster. We've got a lot of fun things planned for 2023, so go ahead, follow Classic Disaster, follow Sanctify Studios and go ahead and subscribe to the podcast Sanctify Radio. Till next time, guys, I will see you in the next video. Take care.